you know it's going to come back onto this trend up here it's got a break up to here and it's going to do a double pop this could be the cup and handle that does it let me zoom in and we will see that it's literally landed on every so let me put it on the 30 minute okay so we have the bottom trend lines and we have this one here let me make it bigger so we can see them and that's all it's done is fell back onto that That's all it's done. That's all it's done. It's fall back onto that. So soon it should start going back up. Now on the four hour, the RSI is looking good. So let me pull this in so you can see the RSI now. Nah, I mean. It's literally resting right on. Yeah. We got the moving average just at 49, and we've got this down here. So, yeah. And if this goes lower, this moving average is going to touch this white line, and this. Uh, RSI should possibly come down here down to this like 26 that should drag it right down uh, but I doubt it I think it's gonna go up because uh, yeah, that's for when the RSI gets to the top it's gonna spunk back down but yeah let's have a look at this it looks like the RSI is in contact but I want it to drag down to this line here so have a sharp fall down to here and then start making a recovery because if it has a sharp fall now it means the climb would be even bigger the RSI should drag it down but the price should not fall too much it's probably gonna lose like 15 percent um let's see bitcoin different charts showing different things so let's see my bitcoin chart oh let's draw this in Let me just stretch this out because and I've got to do this one as well. Oh, damn, I just made the wrong fucking thing. There we go. So now let's zoom in. It's going to come up to this this orange up here and it could get there by Wednesday the 25th of October it should be back up here at the 31 uh, it should happen way before then but yeah we'll have to see we'll have to see uh, this still has the chance to come down and retest this here that's at 20k just above 20k just under 21k so it could do that just to test everyone and then we've got this zone here which is 21 and a half where it could settle and start making a substantial climb back up 
that will bring the RSI down. The RSI is actually on the downtrend while the moving average is on the uptrend. Now let's compare this to my other Bitcoin chart. This one shows my safety zones as well. So let me get rid of the volume. Uh, so that's better. So it's likely gonna retouch this. And if it wants to be a real bitch, it's gonna retest this here and then it's going to start going back up uh, let's see my prediction my prediction was there and i made that prediction when it was up here so so far it's going let's see ethereum ethereum looks good ethereum looks like it's at its bottom uh, as you, the reason why I say that is this is the trend look it fell off and now it's going to make its way back up here yeah uh, it's going to get to that 2140 and then it's it should at least put, push for that 5k again um various different jasmine charts that show different things let's see this one this one shows it's on the downtrend even though it looks like it's on the uptrend um, these are all my jasmine charts by the way yeah this one shows that it's fell under my levels so what it will do is this is the triangle so it curves and it will do the curve. I've got it. I've got it drawn here. Uh, I've got to just move this across a little bit like this, so it matches up like that somewhere. Yeah, it's gonna do something like that. It's gonna come back up either way. Jasmine's gonna hit this zero zero seven zero zero eight, and when it when it breaks that. We're gonna we're gonna do some nice movements and I got this one as well. All of my charts indicate slightly different things. That was the end point and now it's just traveling sideways to NORS and uh, push people off and uh, it's interesting that that news about Sony hat came out today it just makes me feel like it was all planned. Yeah.